Coucou les amis, j'espère que vous allez bien. Hello everyone, my name is Anastasia and in today's video we are going to learn two French verbs. Avoir, to have and être, to be. And we will pay a lot of attention to the pronunciation as usual. If you want to sound like natives, if you want to speak with confidence, then keep watching. Just a little reminder before we begin. Please repeat everything after me, pay attention to my articulation and try to imitate it. It's crucial if you want to sound French. Okay, let's get cracking. Before we learn how to conjugate avoir and être, let's learn the French pronouns. Listen and repeat after me. Je, tu, il, elle, nous, vous, il, elle. Let's discuss all strange things that you can see here. The first one is that the pronoun I has two forms. Je and the second one, je plus apostrophe. Why? The second one we will use with verbs that begin with vowel or H sound that is not pronounced in French. For example, je parle français. Je parle français. The verb parle, speak begins with p, consonant. So, it's okay, we just use je. And the next one, j'aime le français. I like the French language. J'aime, the verb aimer, aime. It begins with the sound e, vowel, and we can't use je, just because it doesn't sound nice. Je aime, two vowels together, no. J'aime, j'aime. The next important thing in French language, they have two different pronouns for you. If you talk to someone you know well, I mean to one person, your friend or family, then you use tu, tu, more informal pronoun. But if you talk to a group of people, you will say vous. Or if you speak with someone you have respect, you will say vous, like with a teacher or a professor or just someone you don't know, you will say vous. As you noticed, il. For singular, he is the same as il for plural for them. You pronounce it in the same way. Okay, I hope it's clear with pronouns. Let's learn the verb avoir. Listen and repeat after me. Avoir. J'ai. Tu as. Il a. Elle a. Nous avons. Vous avez. Ils ont. Elles ont. Let's read it one by one. J'ai. J'ai. Make sure you pronounce it in the same way with this A like smile. J'ai. Because it's closed A. J'ai. Tu as. Tu as. To pronounce U correctly, you need to push your lower teeth with your tongue. Tu. 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 And your lips go forward. Tu. It's the pronunciation is tense. Tu. Tu a. And you don't stop. You pronounce two words, tu a, like one. Tu a. Tu a. Il a. I. I. You smile. The pronunciation is tense. I. Il a. Il a. The same thing. Here we have two different words. Il a. a. But we pronounce it like one. Il a. Il a. Imagine that is actually one word. Il a. Il a. And the same in ELA. Only here we have a sound. Your mouth should be widely open. ELA. It's not the same sound as in JE. Here's the difference. JE. E, 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 e. Smile. And ELA. 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 Please notice that my pronunciation is a little bit exaggerated. We need to exaggerate our pronunciation if we want our muscle to remember it. And in real life it will be easier for you to speak French. Nous avons. Nous avons. In nous we usually don't pronounce S. But if the next word begins with a vowel, we have to read this as like z. Nous avons. And it, you can also hear that it sounds like one word. Nous avons. O. The last sound is a nasal o. If you watched my previous video, you already 
previous videos you already know how to pronounce it if not uh, i will explain it very briefly it starts here you push the sound up and it goes out oh and you don't move your jaw oh oh your lips have have the form of o o o o o nous avons vous avez the same thing we have to read as like z nous avons nous avons vous avez vous avez mm -hmm. the next one ils ont ils ont elles ont just some minutes ago i told you that we will read il il for singular in the same way as il for plural but not when the next word begins with a vowel here we have on it begins with o nasal that's why we have to read this as like z il zon el zon i hope you have pain in here because i do and it means that i'm working really really good okay let's go on with the verb être to be listen carefully and repeat after me je suis tu es il est elle est nous sommes vous êtes ils sont elles sont yes this verb is also an irregular one that's why it looks a bit strange let's read it once again je suis je, je. we already know how to pronounce it je, euh, the sound euh, your lips you know make the form like you want to kiss someone euh, euh. je je suis suis we don't read s here je suis and oui is actually one sound uh, we start here u and we go where very quickly to i suis suis and we start the whole word here suis je suis je suis je suis 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 oui is pronounced very quickly je suis tu es tu es basically we have two words here but again we will read it like one tu es il est elle est okay let's move on nous sommes we don't read a s in the end nous sommes vous êtes here we will read s in vous like z vous êtes vous êtes and we don't read the last two letters vous êtes ils sont ils sont t is not pronounced elles sont t is not pronounced guys i think you got it that wasn't that difficult yeah please let me know in comments and now let's just i don't know have some examples with those verbs je suis nastia j'ai 22 ans je suis blogueur je suis linguiste j'ai une sœur nous sommes à los angeles translate all the phrases that i've just said in comments and i will give you my feedback guys thank you very much for this practice i have a lot of ideas for my next videos and just let me know in comments that you're interested in it in the french pronunciation and if you are i will be really really happy to share my knowledge and just to help you out push the like button subscribe to my channel and i hope to see you in my next videos merci les gars bisous et au revoir a bientôt